yeah india yes. versus australia odi series we had um, high expectations i went for 30 prediction you went for 21 predictions oh god finally it is 12 yeah such a worst uh, performance from indian batting especially and uh, we had uh, the series in our control until the last m- match but we gave it away what was your thoughts yeah i think we should take this as a eye opener yeah that everything is not well in our team sometimes when you get that first win against australia in the home conditions where the world cup is played you can tend to get yeah, more confident but at the same time australia made realize this yeah, made us realize that uh, it's not sometimes always about the conditions yeah mm. it's about the game out with a positive mindset and the way they changed from 1 to 20 or to the second game that showed their mindset their owners were literally banging every ball it was not just a classy game it was mm. a dominant game for both teams so i think that set the tone for them yeah? obviously their bowling was excellent to pull them out we had our own four shots missions yeah but at the same time that had the confidence that even in the third odi when they were and they had their backs to the wall they had the confidence that they can come back uh, to the winning position after getting put out yeah so i think this is the mindset any team needs to win the world cup you mm-hmm. cannot have to win the world cup yeah india has had multiple out days in the crucial semi final quarter final matches when we have lost by 10 wickets in century yeah so if you want to win the world cup you have to have that 2011 mindset every mm-hmm. team what you cannot have an out day if one person or half the team is not performing other half has to step in yeah yeah to- definitely definitely yeah. so okay. i i feel like uh, india plays uh, well in a bilateral series but yes. it is uh, one one of those uh, series as which uh, india had their moment india had its moments but couldn't um, capitalize on it especially i was so confident when um, virat and uh, hardik were batting yes. i felt like this is easy we had seen many times virat uh, go and chase the target easily but once he missed time the ball and after that there's nothing no more left and uh, uh, one shocking performance from this series is surya kumar yadav mm-hmm. three ducks in a row oh, uh, from scoring like a crazy 100 of uh, 35 balls and now so i think every great cricketer great. has to go through that highs and lows isn't it cricket is a level of great level yes so we need to stay humble and uh, fight back i think um, but uh, subman gill's uh, shots have seen highlights oh my goodness his cover drives the pull shots he was in a great touch but like always he gives away his wicket cheaply just like rohit sharma we were scoring so good so freely in the first power play in the third uh, odi but uh, all of a sudden the poor shot selections again and uh, it's not great deliveries oh i agree um, stark had a great game in the Uh, second ODI, but uh, third one definitely nothing, nothing special. Like we couldn't pick Zampa. I mean, I, I couldn't believe that, and we couldn't pick Ashton Yeager. Like in our conditions, couldn't believe that. Yeah, I think India need uh, to focus a bit more on the white ball game. They are very good in red ball game, but um, white ball. I feel that um, that this is where my lack of interest in white ball. game starts especially in odis because of this kind of performances so now let's talk about um, indian team for the world cup so do you think whatever the team we have is good enough yeah uh, i think uh, it, uh, just with the back i think it, it's just that uh, it's not that our players are not good enough but they are in reserves on the bench but i think uh, we need that fire power yeah someone who can take the wickets in the beginning yeah or who can wipe the deal quickly so i think that could be a good inclusion uh, obviously the shot pump won't be ready by then but uh, i think what we need to do is we need to still back so that my i think is a great time yes we are off series but we cannot rule him out of how good a match with this mm. uh, in, his position is not stable in 2020 it's very clear that he can come at number 4 he can play anchor innings as well as finish but in the 50 over that is where we need to fit him very well Yeah, so we tried him at number four, number seven position was unlucky to work. But I think still think uh, after that, number five it is his best position. Mm. Yeah, then he can change all the And uh, yeah, we, and Strayas uh, was not playing in the series. He was our number four, and he had good yes. average. So um, Surya Kumar Yadav was not uh, in ODIs before, so he was meant only for T20s. Yes, I think he performed well. Yes, he did well against uh, Sri Lanka. I think it was well taken. But uh, I think what I think was that I think uh, there are not enough games left before the World Cup. 
discussions mm-hmm. number 4 it could be either shreyas or surekumar yeah. yadav number 5 um, is fixed now it is always kl rahul um he is it is he is fixed in odis yes and uh, number 6 it was uh, rishabh pant and but i think now because of rishabh pant uh, yeah, hardik is coming yeah. in and yeah. then akshar patel because of his good form and then the, if there is any if there are any positions that are fixed that's ravindra jadeja that's uh, fixed and uh, now there is a discussion about kuldeep or chahal um yeah it's a it's a good discussion but i would say kuldeep because of his variations but right. some some prefer uh, chahal because he's a very intelligent bowler it's a good debate and after that um then we have uh, two fast bowlers so shami is yeah, given shami. Yeah. and then uh, it has to be i don't think there is a contest between siraj and bumrah so mm-hmm. so it is bumrah so i think that's a decent uh, odi setup but uh, the problem is uh, we tend to crumble in big moments yes. so and uh, i also felt that uh, in the third match whenever india was in a good position i i think like players were in a mindset of going back to ipl so they didn't put any efforts at all like I, that was a poor performance from every player like choosing wrong shots going for something huge locks i feel like um, ipl is playing in their mind which is not too far away so and you know what ipl is starting next friday it is yeah, there is no gap at all there is just no time to play people uh, teams have to adjust quickly they have to fly back and of course it's what you that's why rich sharma talked about managing the workload mm. it's so important before the world cup after the after this ipl immediately then world test final championship again i mean it, it, it's hard for the players but at the same time it is important that focus and the goals for this year the next year if the goal is to win the world cup you cannot have ipl in mind while playing the monday international against australia in yeah the i think uh, the goal of all I, i'm just uh, saying uh, this is my opinion like uh, i feel most of the indian players goal is to play in ipl and um, get good money it is normal because it's very lucrative to go and play two months and get couple of million dollars so it's good yes um, individuals yes they can have goals yeah but a lot of the players who are actually playing for indian team will end mm, up getting yes. ipl for much very easy yeah i think as a team as a collective mm. it you also have a goal Yeah, if Rahul mm-hmm. Ravi Shastri then wasn't as a coach, yeah, or even Kelly Preston, they had a team, and mm-hmm. I think it is obviously in their mind that in this World Cup, which is happening in our country, we are not going for more. There is a team yeah, it's a big, big uh, um, miss for Indian team being performing so good and not winning any ICC trophy from last decade. Uh, it's a big, big uh, loss. I think this is a big year for India because the World Cup is at home and uh, we have a strong team. I really hope we do it and. Uh, yeah for the next couple of months we won't be talking about international cricket it's all uh, our uh, ipl and um, i'm very excited to see um, the ipl team selections uh, what plays in the players minds like it is very competitive i really enjoy watching ipl so maybe we'll do one more on uh, ipl looking forward yes. to talk about it yes.